What is up, guys? Your friend Steak here. Welcome back to Hollow. Let's play Hollow. Oh fuck! Let's play Hollow Knight. <laughs> Where we left off last time. Well, we had some fun in the green path. We killed a couple bosses. The Wasp, I believe her name was. We have gotten a uh, journal here, so we can actually check out. It was the Hornet. Eh, kind of like the Wasp, am I right? And when we came out of the hole to buy some stuff, because we have a fancy amount of coin coinage here, we are met by this guy. Hello. Santa. Pale thing, you wear that nail with ease. If you're in search of combat, you'll find no great wars with this decaying burrow. I heard an arena exists somewhere below, one built for our like. Meet me there, and I'll test the skills you possess. I'm heading down to Come find me if you dare. Okay, so, like an arena master of sort. Magaula. Many used to come, hoping the kingdom would fulfill their desire. Hollow Nest is it once called, supposedly the greatest kingdom that ever was, full of treasure and secrets. Hmm. Now it's nothing more than a poisonous tomb full of monsters and madness. Everything fades away eventually, I suppose. Okay, same depressing speech as before. As we come into here, I'm gonna buy this overpriced fucking key. And I'm gonna buy this fucking mask shard. Oh. Don't know what that did, but that looks seems kind of badass. Now let's just dash our ass. Here we go, boys. Simple key. Here we fucking go. What's in here? Really? What the fuck? Uh, Welcome, small intruder. Uh, I've been sound asleep in here for some time. Some time? Ah, yes, yes. Well, now that you're gonna woke me up, it's no matter. I suppose I might even be able to help you. I'm Gigi. If you found your way into my chamber, you must need my help. See, sometimes we leave our regrets behind in the world. Like black stains. If we don't deal with these regrets, hope starts to drain from us. Do you have any regrets of your own, little one? Let me peer into you for a moment. Ah, you don't appear to have any lingering regrets. How lucky for you. You don't need the services. Regrets, huh? What? Sorry. I think this is it has to do something with the respawn mechanic or the secret and the spirit. I basically just paid 950 smackers for absolute shit. So, I digress. Now, what we're supposed to be doing is, I believe, is going back down and finishing off uh Ooh, that gives me access to a shield. So, there's a bit of stuff we could actually do. There's a map that we have down here. We could go to the green path and continue exploring a little bit. But I actually want to go to the Forgotten Crossroad and dink around here for a little bit. Because I feel like there's some stuff that we actually can get. There's a couple more things that we could do, I believe. First, let's check up on this monastery over here. That everyone kind of checks out. See if anyone has come. It was entered last episode. Some god spoke to me. That still does that. Nothing too much over here. There were a couple of caterpillars that we could have also saved. I think around here. I will be doing some re-exploration in regards to a lot of things. Why? Because there's so much shit I can explore. There's so much new, there's so many new areas I can try out and stuff as such. So, with that being said, let's have fun exploring. Fuck you. So we fell all the way to the bottom, but that's okay. Because most adventures start from the bottom up. It seems like we cannot re-kill bosses. But I do remember up here. Oof, so 
so close. See, this is what I'm talking about. We have new areas we can check out. Maybe we need to double jump over there. So, that's going to remain locked off for now. I don't believe we actually sat on the bench up there. So, that's kind of concerning. Ooh, also, we can't get through that, so we're going to ignore that. Oh, hey, buddy, what's up? Oh, fuck. There we go. Yikes. So maybe I should stop being so cocky when I play this game. Health. Some health. Okay. Who's over here, huh? God, everything seems to kill me this game, huh? Ah, oh, fucking hell. I don't understand why people call this Dark Souls uh, platforming. I mean, honestly, this is a little difficult, and yeah, there's boss battles and stuff like that, but I don't feel like this game is in any way, shape, or form as hard as it is compared to... Let's just fucking get out of here. Because you guys are fucking annoying. Where are the worms and stuff like that? Forgot where, but there's a worm I can save somewhere. Oh, hello there. Yeah, pale thing used the old lines, pathetic. A real warrior carries himself to combat. He has no need for such conveniences. is I guess pay yeah what is this gonna what does this do huh oh <gasps> the fuck oh, greetings so little old. ones I it's been an age since I last heard the ring of station bell that go down the side Stagway and called me to. I've grown stiff and tired of these many years. I've forgotten much, but the sound of the bell always calls me back. These stagways stretch deeps of hollow nest. If you want me to travel them, hail me from the platform. I'll take you where you need to go. I see another takes rest upon the bench. There's something unpleasant about him, but his stag station doors are open to all. If you request passage, I'll offer it gladly. My duty is to stag far outweighs any personal distaste. All right, you ready to go? Leave me be. It's a really nice speak. I've already wasted too far along these cursed roads. Okay. 
Okay. So. So you can take me to Dartmouth. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is the train station. The stag wish is open. That building was silent even before my time. However, the tales of glorious lines, a web of tunnels running out throughout the kingdom. Not that I'll be tarving them. Mind you, I'm quite content where I am. Fair enough. Seems like this town's starting to come alive the more and more I work on it. So I like to see that little bit of interaction. But I feel like we need to go into the green path and there's a couple stuff I think but that's like all sp oh I have the dashing ability I can go into the green path now and do the stuff that requires me to dash but there's like worms over here that oh fuck sorry about that there's like <sighs> okay I think I know where I need to go Okay, I think it's this path. Yep. I'm not going to say for certain, but I have a feeling that it's going to be this path. Yep, told you. Okay, buddy, don't worry. Hell yeah. Saved another one. Okay. Going to heal up. to take on green path here. Oh, killed myself. Lol. I'm bad. Alright. So it seems like I just go... Well, we gotta keep going straight here anyways. Because now we're in green path and I just have to run this gauntlet again. Dissolve to death. And I dissolve to death. Guess an eye for an eye, huh? Wait, why can't I jump up there? What the fuck? Wait, I have no brain cells, that's why. When I start doing that, I'm gonna do like the hoodooken. Oh shit. Yep. Get roasted. Hadouken! There we go. Journal updated. Oh. Shit. Plant-like bugs swollen with infection releases to the gas with threat. And the gas that seeps from their growth smells invitingly sweet, but it'll burn through shell and flesh if you get too close. Interesting. Going, huh? Take a little rest. And keep dashing, dashing through the snow. Okay, and then it seems like our next objective is just to go down. But not too far down. I like how the maps are very, like, fuck out of here. 
I like how everything like intertwines in such a beautiful, uh, ornate way because this isn't just a straight linear. This thing has curves to it. I mean, this thing has secret passages to it, okay? I suck at dashing, okay? This game is fucking beautiful. Oops. And I don't know if you guys can really tell, but this is 10.30 at night, okay? I'll do little timestamps just to show you how late I'm actually staying up to play this game because this game is mesmerizing. And I actually just want to play the fuck out of it. Yeah. Sorry, right, boys. Get, get gronked. Come on, buddy. Fuck with me. Fuck you. Oh, I died. I feel like that key was completely... Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yikes. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm not supposed to be down here. I'm supposed to be up here in the map mechanic. I love that. I love how they make that a thing, how you need to have a map in order to get a better like understanding of where you are. I like how they make things like expensive, so okay, can we not And I like how this game punishes you for being dog shit too. Look at me, look how far I fucking died, and now I gotta go all the way back. Makes you not be cocky, like some games get. Like, in, like, Fallout 4, or, like, I know this is completely different game genres, but, like, in certain game, well, here, I can apply this to anything, you get to a certain point in most games where you just get so fucking broken, like, you're so over-the-top powerful that none of your actions really have consequences, you can start dinking around in that stuff, but now that I have this new range of moment, movement, it actually punishes me, because this game is still fucking hard. I love the health regenerating system. It's a beautiful aspect of this game. Overall, I just fucking love how everything matters. Fucking hell. Dude, seriously, Jesus Christ. I like how when you're dead, your fucking health meter is broken, like you're missing a part of yourself. Okay. Boom, back in it. Let's go. Actually, what are my runes that I have on charms that I have on right now? Oh, dude, soul catcher. I almost need that. I feel like I'm only going to have three notches during this entire game. That's definitely going to put me in a weird spot.
Yeah, now we're getting to the spiny part of the game. Okay, yeah, here's the spiny part, boys. This is clearly not the way I'm supposed to go. At almost, yeah, I'm almost 132%. Certain that it's like not the way you're supposed to go. But then that leaves me with questions like, how the fuck do you get up here? Where am I supposed to go next? What am I missing in this game? Let's get a shit out of me. I was like, fuck, this is it. This is the end, boys. And you have these cool little soul recharging stations over here. So, I guess we just gotta keep on exploring at this point, right? Apparently, the game says I haven't been up here yet. And just like that, my sense of curiosity has been craved. I mean, yeah, you can say my sense of curiosity is not like a good sense, but dude, this shit is fucking fun. All those mosquitoes just to get some fucking money? Yes, sir. Please and thank you. That's what I love because now we're in a completely different part of the game. Like, this game awards your rewards your sense of like discovery. We have the part already where, um, uh oh. Okay, so you can't dash through people. Boom. Look at that map is updated. So there's more shit over there that I need to do. And actually, I didn't even realize that there was a passage over here. Like, that's what the game's implying that there's like a passage. There's supposed to be a passage. Ah, uh, the passage is more up more. Ooh, 
Yeah, I would have never realized this was here. But it is here. And it's fucking cool. Oh shit, there's a boy down there. Heal up. Nope, oh, that's enough for the heals. Oh, there was money back there. Yeah, I feel like... Oh, shit. Yeah, this game definitely, like, rewards your ambition. Oh, fuck. Fuck, I can't stop playing this. I wanted to. Ooh, fuck. Get out of here, Bilbo. Oh. It's a beautiful game. The music, the soundtrack is just inviting. This is something I'm actually just gonna binge tonight until I can't play it anymore. But that's the thing. This isn't like Hearthstone or something like that that you can just get bored of because it's the same shit over and over again. This game is fucking constantly changing. And fucking crazy ass shit. Fuck, I'm like, I'm almost dead. Like, where did that take me? It took me over here. And this is like some area that conjoins to the like starting area over here. Where did this take you? It took you over here. Is there a safe spot anywhere over here? No, but look at this shit. That's where the chick was before. Or the hornet was. We're gonna heal up once. And that's about, ooh, fuck. And that's like another zone completed. All that we gotta do is get back to the safe spot, you know? Easier said than done, I know, for sure, but... I mean, shit. Uh-oh. I died. Now I gotta go all the way fucking back. Eastern map updates, like, accordingly, but I gotta go to the fucking other side of the world again. Uh-oh. Okay, we're just gonna start that over. I'm gonna end the video with me getting my fucking life bag. Boom, and you get your soul back like that, and you boom, and you fucking delete these old shits like Kachiga. And that's what I'm talking about, ladies and gentlemen. Man, we got so much more exploring we gotta actually do. Holy shit, and I forgot there's like a passage right here. Get the fuck out of my swamp. There's a passage right here that I completely forgot about. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Jennifer Dinner Steak here, playing some more Hollow Knight. We've basically been just fucking around exploring, but I keep finding new shit. And this game just, you need to pick this up right now. It is $10 on Steam. Oh, what the fuck is that? That's electricity. This game keeps pulling me in. 
Anyway, guys, this has been Dinner Fried Dinner Steak here playing Hollow Knight, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye! -bye.